hey there everybody how y'all doing hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night and welcome back to my channel as always i'm deluxe all right let's do another freaking transform review because i love some freaking transformers i love some magic square too as well but today we'll be taking a look at ms-03 heavy gunner this is their brawl from the combaticons and he is mp scale so they did they, they upscale these guys and i'm really excited for them this is my favorite combiner i love the combat uh, combaticons and everything so i'm really excited to do this so there you go. The front of the box looks good. Love the artwork. Magic Square, heavy, heavy Gunner. Changes from tank to robot. All that good stuff. Here you go. On the side, very nice. Got a kind of G1 kind of thing going on. And definitely back here, you do got some stats. You want to look at that real quick. Nice little silhouette of Brawl. Made in China. All that good stuff. Same thing over here. And underneath, uh, you got to be 16 years old to uh, play with this thing. So awesome. All right, man. Really excited for this. So let's get right to it and see what he comes with. First thing first, they do come with a little nice collector card. Nice thick stock. Really like that heavy gunner. Down the back, you got some stats if you want to polish for the calls. Very nice. Instructions. Easy peasy. Uh, transforms just like the Legend Scale one. So, yeah, there you go. Uh, it comes with his double, you know, bo uh, double barrel blaster right here. And this is painted, which is really a lot. There's some really great paint on this guy. Uh, but this one is painted. Got the nice gray got the nice sheen to it so it looks good now you do have a flip down anything i guess he may can hold this or something so if i guess if you point it this way he can probably hold it so that's pretty cool i don't think the uh the uh, legend scale one unfortunately i don't have my legends one out i have them put up uh, so i won't be able to do any comparisons but there's some there's some reviewers out there that have already done it i'm sure they've done some comparisons it's the same thing it looks the same thing uh but i'll show you that but yeah it looks good and you get his gun i don't think the gun is painted um it's gray plastic i think and you can flip this down too as well. Uh, so you can hold it or you can put it on the tank. That's cool. You get these two little fog lights, I guess. They're nicely painted. You got some nice uh, yellow kind of a uh, translucent plastic right there. That's pretty cool. You get two of those and you get the combiner foot. Now, I don't know if they're going for the, so the, the toy version has the gray, but the tune version does not. It should have been green, I think. Uh, so I guess they might be going for the toy version for this one. I'm not for sure, but uh, the first one they you know put out was Tune Deco. Um, but yeah, so you just flip this out like this. It does have a ratchet, you know, uh, rocker, and it has a nice uh, ratchet for the foot too as well. So that's pretty cool. But yeah, I'll probably uh, you know combine this. It's real easy. I'll show you that in a little bit. But yeah, there you go. That is what he comes with. Whee! All right, and here is Heavy Gunner, or Brawl, in his alt mode, and looks exactly the same as the Legend Scale, but instead he is MP Scale, and he's got paint on him. Now, I was going to tell you right now, it is a pain in the taint. I've got, you know, dimples in my fingers trying to push this, because the green is painted, and the gray is painted, so all that's a little thicker, so it's a little thicker for the hole, giggity, and it took forever. I'm not, I'm not going to take these out at all. Um, but yeah, this was a pain to taint to get, push this through, man. Really, really hurt my fingers. Cause like I said, there's paint on paint and it's a little thicker, so it's not going in the hole. So just be wary of that. Uh, you know, hopefully yours don't be that bad, but man, that was a pain to taint right there, but looks good. I really, really like it. Like I said, the gray is painted. The green is painted. Um, very nice. Looks like taint. Looks like I said, it's bigger than, you know, the, uh, legend scale. Uh, you know, everybody should know that by now. Um, but yeah, it looks good. I really, really like it. Some nice scope work. Got the little tanks back here and everything. That's very nice. It does have wheels on the bottom, so it will roll just fine. You can move the turret around and you can move it up as well like that. It's a little tight. Be careful. Like I said, the paint right there is really thick on there. Uh, you can extend it, you know, you know, move it like that. That's pretty good. Go all the way around you can go all the way around you can lift it up a little bit like that if you want to clear it you know so you don't want to scratch up the paint and everything so very nice you got that and that is cool like i said you got some nice scope work on the treads so yeah it looks pretty good so what you can do you can take your guns you know you can post you know like i said a little tight in there like i said be careful the freaking paint is i love that they put paint on there because magic square is not known for their paint um but yeah it's a little tight and this will go, I think this will go right here. I think it's going to go, yeah, uh, let's see. No, I think it goes the other way. I'm sorry. It goes this way. So, yeah. 
We just gotta fit it in the hole just right like that. Move these up like this. And there you go. Now it won't turn or anything like that. But yeah, it looks pretty good. Move that up there. So there you go. There he is all armed up, man, ready to blast some Autobots. And like I said, it looks pretty, pretty good. Spot on. Um, what I'll do, I'll put a picture of the uh, Legend Scale right there if you want to look at it. Uh, like I said, I don't have mine out, but I do have them. Uh, there you go. You can look at that. Awesome. All right, there you go. There is Brawl in his alt mode. I think it looks freaking awesome. You got the translucent yellow right there. I didn't show you that as well. But yeah, pretty good. There you go. Right, there is Alternator's Hot Rod. And we got Fans Toys Jazz. And there's some scale for you.
I'm back to transformation and here is Brawl. Uh, I like the transformation just like the legend scale one. So if you transformed him, you you know, have a good time with this one. Kind of ate me up on the legs. I kind of forgot some certain points, but uh, it's really, you know, once you get the hang of it, not terrible at all. And it doesn't have the gummy plastic. I know a lot of people don't like that plastic. I kind of understand why they use it. Kind of gives it more of a tune deco. And, it, you know, kind of with their engineering, sometimes it helps them with that as well. But this is hard plastic. Really nice. I like it. Everything mostly is painted. All this green, all this gray is uh, painted. Be careful. I do have a little scratch right here. So with great paint comes great scratches. So just be wary of that. So yeah, just be careful. Uh, like I said, all this is nice to paint. The head sculpt looks good. Love the red and the orange. The orange head crest and the gray is painted once again. Uh, you can look down a little bit. Not much. You can look up quite a bit. That is good. All the way around. No attitude. All right. With the arms. Nice ratcheted. I like that. You get about the full 90 almost. Give it to them a little bit. Nice ratchets all the way around. And then you have a butterfly as well. So you got extended right there, you know, like this. And you got the backwards and you got the forwards. And that is nice. I like that. All right. So you have a nice elbow bend, a little more than 90 degrees. So not terrible. You got a bicep swivel. With the hand, you have a swivel and a in or just a basically out like that on a hinge. And you got uh, two points of articulation with the fingers. You got one at the base and one at the knuckle. That's very nice. You got the, you know, jazz hands. Ha, cha, 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 cha. I like that. So very nice on the hands. Okay. So you do have a waist swivel, but you had to kind of move this out of the way a little bit to get the full so you won't scrape into anything like that. So kind of have to move that out a little bit and you get the full waist swivel. Kind of sucks that way, but, you know, just be careful with that. All right. And you do have a nice nice ab crunch and you can look up doesn't defeat the purpose of the ab crunch i like that very nice all right so you got these side flaps you flip this out flip this out and nice hard ratchets daddy likes some ratchets mm. full van dam all day every day all right now to go up like i said you do the skirt goes with it make sure it does have a drop down make sure you use that so you won't scrape anything like that on the you know each piece right here and you can get quite a bit up there so that's a nice kick and everything and like i said nice ratchets right there as well and then you can go back about you know to about there then you start running into the turret but you got nice right there so make sure you do that all right and like i said use the drop down because it will help a lot all right it does have a thigh swivel that's good you do have a nice knee bend you get more than 90 degrees a single joint right there very nice and no toe tail up or down but you do have a nice rocker that is good. I like that. On the back, like I so said, you can move this turret if you want to, however you want to, or you can extend it. That's good. All that niceness looks good. No waffles. All this is painted. Looks freaking awesome. So there you go. That is Brawl. All right, real quick with the weapon. So you got his gun. Uh, you can store it back here if you want to, just like you had in the tank. That's easy peasy. And, or you can flip this down or flip, yeah, flip this up. And on his hand, he does have a little slot right there. And you just tab this in and you close the fingers around it and there you go he'll hold it just fine all right then you take the double barrel cannon and he does have a little you know, tab right here he has a slot on his forearm on his forearm you can tab it in there and you can use it as that if you want to or you can fold this out and just like the small gun you can let's see if i could try to do this without knocking them over but you can just tab it in there close his hand or fingers and there you go he is all armed up that is awesome you have options so that's pretty cool and uh, i did show you that you can uh, like i said i don't have the legend scale one but i'll do a, i'll throw a picture up there and you can see some comparisons right there all right so there you go there is brawl and his weapons all right so the mp44 Optimus prime and you got mitigate shatter and then you got X Trend Spots Bulkhead, you got Runabout and Runamuck. And then you got Generation Toy Sideswipe, you got Takara Masterpiece Sideswipe, and you got Tits McGee Ratgar. And that's some scale for you. And Crapper Garnets, Crappy Toilet Paper, AAA Battery, Car Mix, K Bears, Kicker and Squeaks. More scale. Well, hey there, everybody. How y'all doing? You made this far as always. I freaking appreciate that. All right. Final thoughts on Magic Square Heavy Gunner. This is their brawl in MP scale. I love it. Cannot wait to get the rest of them. I think this is going to be a good set. I really do. 
Um, I think a lot of people were, you know, a lot of people always in the comments saying, if they were just bigger, I'd, you know, definitely get them. Well, here's your chance. Uh, a lot of people want the Megatron. I'm sure that, more, you know, down the line, they'll probably do a MP scale Megatron as well. But yeah, this guy is, is really good. Really, like I said, I'm really excited for that. The tank mode looks good. I like it. Uh, you know, it's a splitting image of the uh, Legend Scale one. You know, if you have that one, um, you know, the uh, transformation engineering, kind of, the legs kind of ate me up during the transformation, but once you do it a couple of times, you get used to it. It's, it's no thing. Like I said, it's got the same transformation just about as the uh, Legend Scale one as well. So the materials. So a lot of people don't like the material, you know, the soft, you know, gummy plastic. Well, this one doesn't have that. It's really nicely done. Nice plastic. I like that. Um, either way, I mean, I like the gummy stuff too as well. If they would have done it in this, you know, for MP scale, it wouldn't bother me at all. But I know it bothered a lot of people. But I think it kind of gives more of a tune uh, deco, and I, I like that and everything. So, uh, but yeah, the materials feel good. The paint is spectacular. My gosh, all the green, all this grayish painting. Just be careful. With great paint comes great scratches. I did a little bit right there on my thigh. But other than that, I think I did a great, you know, pretty good job. Uh, but just be careful, you know, you're scraping and everything. You don't want to, you know, scrape off the paint. I love the weapons. I love that you have two options. You can use this on your side of the, you know, right here on your arm. And you can hold it. And that's pretty cool. And uh, they're painted, so that's really nice. I like that. Love the head sculpt. Uh, articulation is great. You have everything. You have an ab crunch. You have a, a butterfly. You can look up. All that good stuff. Only thing maybe really you need a toe tilt up or down. But other than that, great on the articulation. Like I said, materials feel great. I think a lot of people are going to like this. I think they're going to be great. I'm not looking forward to uh, transforming Vortex, man, because that was a pain in the butt to uh, transform in Legend Scale. Maybe they simplify it, and hopefully they do that. So we'll see. But yeah, overall, I think it's going to be a great set. I just want, if Magic Square is watching, which more than likely they're not, keep on doing Legends and show their next combiner for Legend Scale. I'm ready. I want a Defensor or whatever, Copytron, whoever you want to make, but keep on doing Legend Scale. I know you want to do, you know, the MP scale and everything, but man, it, you know, please don't, you know, get away from doing Legend Scale. So, hope you like my review. Hope I went over everything. Oh, uh, combine mode is solid too as well. You get the uh, nice uh, combiner foot and everything. I know a lot of people didn't like the gray and everything because I think it's supposed to be tuned, but I don't, you know, I don't know for sure. Uh, but yeah, it's solid and it's going to be great. I think the Bruticus is going to be freaking awesome. I cannot wait to combine him. So, Hope you like my review. Hit me up some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Hit that sub button for me if you don't mind. Hit me up some comments. Some of you thought of the review. Are you getting this guy? Um, I think uh, he's under 100 bucks on a show Z. You know, definitely, you know, worth it. You know, it's not a whole lot. You know, it's not going to break the bank or anything like that. Definitely, if you go to show Z, hit up there, the Deluxe 32 at the top. It really helps out the channel. And, um, yeah, I guess I'll see you on the next Transformer review. And, as always, be good to yourself. Help freaking Transformers and help freaking Magic Square, man. This just, man. It's really good. It's fun. It's nice. Wow. I'm, I'm excited for the rest of them, man. Um, yeah. yeah. Boop. And uh, boop. And boop. All right. Good night, folks.